hello friends welcome back in OCP technology and uh, let's continue with the Oracle data card today I'm going to demonstrate you how to convert your physical standby into snapshot standby okay in that case you can open your database in read write mode and this technology is going to use flashback feature okay so we have need to enable the flashback feature for the standby database what it does it's create the point in a flashback and from that point it will allow you to update the database but as soon as you go back it will discard all the changes that you are made so here archive log file shifted from the primary to standby but it will be not applied to the standby database okay so let's see how to convert the physical standby into <coughs> snapshot standby so right now on the my physical machine check the mode just run that command and you can check that physical machine mode what is current mode you can see your current that machine mode is physical standby okay this is the mounted so let's how to change it in the snapshot standby just shut down immediate then start up the database in mount stage so start up mount now check the flashback mode using that command flashback underscore on so you can see your flashback feature is no okay if it is no then change it in yes using that command like alter database convert to snapshot standby okay then enter now open your database alter before that you can check the mode of the flashback you can see here the restore point is created okay so now you can open your database alter database open okay after that you can check the database open mode using that command so you can see here the database mode op open in read or write read write mode and database role is snapshot standby okay so <coughs> now you can create a table over there create table Scott dot emp2 as select star from score dot emp so you can see I'm able to create a table over there okay yeah, it's created now if you want to retrieve the record from the emp2 table you can see star from score dot emp2 so you can see you can retrieve the record from the emp table emp2 table okay so now from here you can modify modify you can do your modification in your database but uh, it's not going to affect your primary machine server no? as soon as you can you can see the snapshot all changes will be rolled back okay if you uh, cancel your snapshot so what you change is uh, run what you changes you done on the standby machine your all changes will be rolled back after cancelling the flashback okay so let's see how it is work so I'm going to get back my physical standby just shut down immediate start up mount then alter database 
convert to physical standby sorry spelling mistake then sit down again and start up no mount then alter database mount stand standby database now applying the archaeology files alter database recover manage standby database disconnect okay now if you want to check your flashback feature press back on so you can see it's disabled okay so this is the complete method how to switch uh, the your physical standby into snapshot standby okay i hope you got that video very informative thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe my channel and like my video